Nowadays, people speak a lot about failure. Failures are, are painful. When they happen, you suffer, but it's a part of the game. I think failure is, is, can happen, and um, you should always try to do everything that's possible to not fail, obviously, but you learn even when you fail. You know, everything, all experiments are a process of failure. That's how you work out whether something, uh, something works or not. Um, it's only really failure if you don't learn from these things. I think fear is a good thing because you should keep your eyes on the prize and you should be goal-driven. But it's not the end of the world and it's not something that will kill you. And especially if you're a first-time young founder, you have virtually nothing to lose except your free time. I think it's, it's very important that, that you give yourself the freedom to fail and be afraid since that's the like only sign that you're going to a direction that isn't like the like clear one to you. And that's how you learn and that's how you get better. So I really think that failure is the biggest choice of knowledge because only if you just screwed it up you know how it feels, you just build it up again and you learn from, okay, what didn't work and what worked. Speak with people and share with them successful stories that started from Europe and successful stories that um, began with a lot of fears, but after that they became successful. Staying very honest, you know, there's no shame in, in, in not succeeding when you've been honest throughout it with, with yourself and with your team. You, you, you make many mistakes, but you, you, you think about it, you learn from it, and you move on. And, um, and that gives you experience, and, and that will make you a great entrepreneur.